Hi there, viewers and gamers alike out there, and welcome to our fourth day in my last event to be in Anime Oasis Premium Adventure as the Amazing Perfect Spider-Man two more times, or, or you know, the Amazing Spider-Man two in two suits of the red and black suit. And don't worry, I have everything under control with the black suit, thanks to Batman. And don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And tell me, who is your favorite Japanese anime cosplayer you like to dress up? Whether it can be that or your favorite DC or Marvel characters. It's time for me to go one last time as the amazing perfect Spider-Man in Anime Oasis Premium. And this is part four. Hope you guys enjoy the following video, and I will always be swinging right behind you. Hello there viewers, and welcome to our last and final day of Day 4 of Anime Oasis. Premium adventure of the amazing Perfect Spider-Man. Emo and whiny equals perfect Spider-Man. So anyways, hope you guys enjoy my ad adventure of somehow in some sort through shattered dimensions, through the edge of time in this place, to the amazing places I've gone through in this event and, and fun times people starting to get a really good liking of me as the amazing perfect Spider-Man of Emo and Whiny. And most, most of all, I love my dearly beloved mother who raised me as a baby because I love her very much. You guys are mama's boys out there who love their moms too. You, you do that, cause I know you guys. So anyways, it's time that we go for another adventure of our final journey. Let's go for one last big hurrah event. So anyways, here we go, and time skip. Okay, still enjoying the anime oasis thing and hopefully, you know, I got a really cool special poster and I'm definitely going to enjoy it and uh, I might show you a little bit later on if I can. It's actually pretty amazing and spectacular even <laughs> and sensational. So, a bunch of cosplayers around here, I'm keeping my distance, so anyways, I am going to find a way to charge up those escalators, and they still haven't been powered up, oh sure, I see the lights there, and look at that, the escalators aren't moving, and the, the lights are still on, why can't it work, it's supposed to I don't understand why. It should have worked a long time ago, but actually, not that long ago. But why doesn't it do it? Why can't it make it work? I need it working. And so, yeah, there was. I call it much ado about nothing on escalators. And so, I'm gonna try to do some more dandy stuff as the amazing perfect Spider-Man. Anyways, top. Hehe, <laughs> way to fly. Way to fly. 
<laughs> he knows how to jump to the camera. I wonder if he did came down to the escalator. Anyways, when I had my bank turn, time skip. So you finally heard the voice and I got a one-liner from Sailor Venus, Sailor Venus, Jeremy Lay, wow, it's, yes, whoever knew that the amazing perfect Spider-Man would have friends in high places, he tries to be a friend around Southwest Idaho. So anyways, I'm kind of right now in the black suit. Switching suits on the fly, I suppose. And also, a picture of me in the red suit with Daryl Gilbo. I kind of said Daniel and not Daryl, and I just pronounce it, so I'm not that perfect. The guy who takes some chances and makes mistakes and get messy. Yeah, that's what I do. A quote from Miss Frizzle from the Magic School Bus. There's still a few more events for me before this is over. So, anyways, we're going to continue to venture around here as much as I can. I'll show you guys a little bit of stuff as far as I can tell. So, anyways, it's time for me to do another time skip. <laughs> Share me those one-liner voices, Taylor Venus. Oh my. Anyways, here we go in. Time skip. Okay, so now that I promised you, I am going to show you a the the spider family of, well, not one, not two, not three, but four amazing spider people. And I bring you this right here. There it is. Ultimate Spider-Man, Miles Morales. Ultimate Spider-Man here. Miles Morales! Yes, I'm wearing the black suit. That is Spider-Woman. Also known, her name is uh, Jessica Jones. Right there is uh, Spider-Gwen. I wish they call her Spider-Girl, but Spider-Gwen. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to be biased. But just, you know, it's... Uh, it's how that goes, I mean, you know how it is. And the next thing I'm going to show you is the autograph, but I'll show you for that later. Anyways, I'm going to, well, actually, I'm going to do that now, so why, why not? I grabbed five out of six autographs, so I'm only going to... I got Bryce's autograph. Here it is. What do you know? <laughs> I got his autograph. Unbelievable. He's act and like I said, he's actually a really nice guy. Really nice actor to meet. Really fun to talk to. And here's I also got uh, Jeremy Lay autograph. Love it. And Daryl Gilbo, along with uh, Leslie Wilkerson and Trina Nishimura. So, um, here it is. Yeah, not bad. I got there. There's Jeremy's autograph, Daryl's autograph, 
Leslie Wilkerson's autograph. Trina Nishimura's autograph. Because I got them all. What does this look like? So I, I already told you that I have met Griffin Puatu. He is. <clears throat> so Griffin Puatu is an American voice actor, voice director, and producer. Born in Glendale, California. So, so whether he's making films, he has performed in musical productions, plays, and impro improvisational theater. He's also worked in production at Alpha Media, Bang Zoom Entertainment, and University Pulse. Some of Griffin's most noticeable voice acting credits include One Man Punch, Hunter X Hunter, Charlotte Griff, the Winged Lion, Asphod Asphodel Project, Detective Butler, Zulapet, Zulaplex, and Dream Keepers, the movie. So five out of six is not bad. I couldn't get Mika Kobayashi, so it's not that easy. But anyways, I'm going to send you to the closing ceremonies and I'll do one last recording and that would be the end of it. So anyways, let's do a time skip. So here we go and time skip. <laughs> Wow. He, he still wants it. <laughs> 
You don't know him. <laughs> I can tell him on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> And that is the end of your closing ceremonies. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this following video. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. 
and tell me, what do you guys think of Anime Oasis Premium? You like it or hate it or whatnot? And leave a comment section below. Because I will always be the amazing, perfect Spider-Man. This is Leo Wolverine saying and speaking as always. Godspeed, play safe and shalom. Excelsior! So, what do you guys think of all the parts of Anime Oasis Premium Adventure? And not to mention, as me, as the amazing, perfect Spider-Man that I am in real life. Thanks to Ember K-Wing that I'm a real superhero with a disability, which is autism. I'll still never forget the words from what she said. And hopefully, I bet you guys enjoyed it as well. I mean, tell me, who is your favorite Japanese anime cosplayer? Who's your favorite DC or Marvel characters out of the comics, if you want to know? Especially that can be, <laughs> you know, <laughs> Disney characters, perhaps. Of course it counts. Uh, <laughs> and so... You guys are still members of my alliance still. Hopefully this will go well sooner or later. But uh, I hope you guys out there be will still be members of my alliance. I know I'm losing a lot of friends on the Xbox Live because I told them I'm not getting an Xbox One. It's just not going to happen. They need to get over it. Because... They need to understand what I'm feeling right now. You can't just say nothing. Say something to still be my friend. Not. If for those who try to not be my friend, well, guess what? You're not a true family member. You're just. You're walking. They're just going on the path of running away. But that is just my opinion. And I. And I was strongly based on that opinion on my own basis. So anyways, bunch of friends from Leonardo's Alliance for those who are members of K-Wing's Let's Plays, which are Wingding fans, including me as well. I'm still as part of the one big family. Yes, I did some around scouting as the amazing Spider-Man fighting off against Imperial Stormtroopers and whatnot and so forth and the Chicken Walkers and defeated Darth Vader and the Emperor himself. Of course, he likes to be so snarly and hysterical. What do you know? It's gonna work. Welcome to the club. We're having jackets made for everybody who's now a family of this alliance here. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching Anime Oasis Premium Adventure as from me, like, playing as the real perfect Spider-Man that I've become. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and, and tell me, what do you guys think? And I will throw in a bonus video. I ain't going to tell you what it is, but I'm hoping it's going to be fun. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I ain't going to tell you what it is. I'm just going to hold it off. So, for anyways, <laughs> once again, this is Leo Wolverine saying and speaking as always. For all those who are now members of my alliance as a family, along with teaming up with the K-Wings, Godspeed, play safe, and shalom. And one more thing before I have to say. I will always be swinging right behind you as the amazing, perfect Spider-Man. Excelsior!